And now the night everyone in the football world has been longing for. Millions will be watching around the world. It is, of course, the biggest final in club football, the UEFA Champions League final. Welcome to the commentary box. Derek Ray here, joined by Lee Dixon. It is Chelsea up against Bayern Munich. Well, I'm so excited for everybody, the fans, everybody connected to both clubs. But it's the players I'm so excited for. I've never actually played in a Champions League final, but played in other finals. I know what they're feeling. We can see the nerves already starting to jangle. How do you cope with those nerves, Derek? How do you settle yourself down before what's going to become probably the biggest game of your career? the lineup for Chelsea. Thiago Silva plays with Kurt Zuma in central defence. N'Golo Conte starts alongside Matteo Kovacic in central midfield. And in attack, it's the very pacey Timo Werner. Well, with the level of competition in Europe, it really is an incredible achievement to make back-to-back -back finals. Only a few teams can claim that. It's certainly not going to be easy, but I tell you, they've got belief, they've got confidence, and I'm pretty sure they all think they can win it tonight. Here's the initial 11 for Bayern. The highly rated Manuel Neuer between the posts. Serge Gnabry plays with Kingsley Coman out wide, and leading the line today, Robert Lewandowski. And now the Champions League final commences. Mateo Kovacic. Here's Chilwell. Well, pressing high is something the visitors like to do. It can take a lot out of any team, but it is very much their game. Lee, would you expect that approach this time? Yeah, absolutely. The press looks on the way the team's set up. High energy is needed for this tactic. Everyone has to buy into it, but the rewards are big, Derek. Werner. Mateo Kovacic. Moving the ball effectively, looking for the right moment. Chilwell, he's given it straight to the opposition. Coman. Hernandez. And back with Coman. Goretzka. This is Alaba. Understandable that we might want to focus on Robert Lewandowski, given his prowess in front of goal. What do you like about his play, Lee? I just love his position in the box. Every time the ball goes wide or in a crossing area, just watch. Goretzka! And a goal for Bayern. They nudge in front. Well, the opening goal in any game is important for the Champions League final. Wow. Well, here's the replay. It's a really good passing move in the build-up. And then the composer is impressive as he smashes the ball with all he has to beat a forlorn goalkeeper. Brilliant strike. So Chelsea restart the game. Can they come up with an answer? Ziyech. Difficult to stop him. Ziyech. Havertz. Mateo Kovacic. Pulisic now. He has time to play it over. Kovacic. 
Werner, and now Havertz. And intercepted it. Well, Chelsea did well to regain control of it. Havertz. Well, still searching for the equaliser, but not passing it anxiously. Well, that takes the wind out of their sails. Great defending. And room now out on the flank. And in the end, he's run out of space. Kai Havertz. Ziyech. Here's Kovacic. Chilwell. Pulisic. Not high quality defending. Coman. This is Müller. And scope for them to produce something exciting. Tony So. Using all his defensive acumen to cut it out. Beautifully weighted ball. Werner. Real chance. And a goal! And what an important goal in the grand scheme of things. Well, it's the sort of determination and desire that's got them here. All the momentum is with them now. Well, here's the replay, and it's a lovely, quick counter-attack that sets up the chance. And once he gets himself settled with the keeper to beat, he hammers it into the back of the net. Smashing goal. Well, the earlier goal cancelled out. What a piece. Serge Gnabry. Now with Tolisso. Pavard, Toliso, Jérôme Boateng. Now it's with Boateng. This is Robert Lewandowski. Toliso, Goretzka has it now. What's he going to do here, Muda? Hernandez. Well, potential danger. Muller. Excellent defending. And that pass could be troublesome. Timo Werner. And they nudge in front. Well, fabulous celebrations. They've got their noses in front, Derek. Can they stay there? Well, let's see the replay and look at the pace at which the counter-attack happens. And when he gets through to the keeper, he just smashes it past him and gives him no chance to think. A lovely finish. So, having conceded, can Bayern hit back? Coman. Bayern Munich certainly controlling the lion's share of possession. After that, it's been a little bit disappointing. Creativity in midfield is a little bit off. Certainly too slow in front of goal. Need to get wide, need to get crosses in the box. Unable to keep the ball that time. And fine work from Chelsea to win the ball back. And the attack looks promising. Oh, in with a chance! Alaba with the block. Can Chelsea use this corner to add to their advantage? And firing it into the area. Well, it has come to nothing. Could cross it in here. Havertz. Kovacic! And a touch of finesse. The goal seemed to be at his mercy, but defenders don't always have to touch the ball to have an influence. No, it's that pressure that comes from the defender that makes him hurry his shot. Close. And one minute of stoppage time has been added on.
Timo Werner. The first half here comes to an end. Into the second half, then, in this battle for Champions League glory. Serge Gnabry just knocking it around, looking to carve out a chance. But he stopped them just when they looked menacing. Pulisic. It might be perfectly set up for the counter attack, you know. Real chance. And now it is there for him. And the keeper nowhere to be found. Not that he's complaining. Well, I'm sure you want to see this again. Where is everybody? The defenders, nowhere to be seen. It's an open goal. So there it is. 3-1 the current scoreline here. Tony so promising move this from Bayern really nice ball and Pulisic has it showing plenty of defensive acumen and conceding the throw-in. Chilwell. Pulisic. Interception to snuff out the danger. He's been admonished by the referee. He's now got to walk something of a tightrope. Yeah, he knows exactly where he stands. Look at the referee, how he's told him off there. No yellow card, but certainly knows what the referee's thinking. Well, here's the replay, and it's easy to ask why the keeper didn't save that. But it's the deception, the disguise, and it's done brilliantly. I love that. Well, the ball is moving again, and Chelsea are quite simply running away with this. And taking it away. Oh, a perfectly timed pass. Oh, nice ball over the top to chase. Save, but still a chance. Oh, and he puts away the second chance. But the goalkeeper angry with himself here. Well, here's the replay. And Derek, a lot of the time, the keeper saved the day. The last line of defence. But he's had a nightmare here. Big mistake. And the goal goes down to him. So the current scoreline, 4-2. And 30 minutes left for play in this match. Pulisic. Happy Having won the ball back, they might be able to profit. From Grandad Stan and Grand. Ziyech. It must go in, surely. There it is. And he could scarcely have had an easier finish. Well, here's the replay. You've got to ask questions about the back line and the goalkeeper. They're simply not there.
Koeman. David Alaba. Here's Hernandez. Thomas Müller. Moving into the advanced position. Mateo Kovacic. Werner. Conte. Timo Werner. And not cleared away properly. That is what you call a guilt-edged opportunity not taken. Well, you visualise the game before you play it, and I'm pretty sure he probably in his sleep visualised an open goal, and he's just fluffed his lines. Well, how many goals are we going to get? The chances are just coming thick and fast. Defensively, they're all over the place. Can they make them pay a little bit more? It looks like they can. Robert Lewandowski with an incisive pass. Douglas Costa has done it! Well, he's so very capable in that sort of situation. Well, here it is again. It's a lovely ball behind, perfectly timed. But you do have to ask questions about the keeper. Could he have done better here? I think so. You can't keep getting beat at the near post like that. Not a scoreline we see all that often. 5-3. Timo Werner. And return to Havertz. Given away by Chelsea. And given that we're in the second half. And it has got a bit ugly from the scoreline point of view. What positives can you find, Lee? Well, what should I give Bayern out of 10? 4? Maybe I'll give him a 5. Lack of intensity, though, not good enough for me. Disjointed team performance, no cohesion. Certainly a lot of work to be done on the training ground next week. Oh, another one for them! And with plenty of time still remaining, this game is very much back on! Well, as we see from the replay, the keeper's got no chance. It's all about the strike, all about the power. He does everything right, head down, back of the net. Neither side shy about shooting in this match. Oh, lovely bit of skill. Chilwell. Conte now. Ten minutes left for play in this match. Douglas Costa on to Hernandez Lewandowski the clock ticking time against Bayern but still they can fight back it look as though they had attacking momentum but not so Havertz and the counter attack is on options available shot attempted well, the keeper wanted to take it cleanly and did Conte. It's with Hakim Ziyech. Conte. Zule stops it. Conte. And Kai Havertz. Overcooked that one. It's been threaded by Lewandowski. for Douglas Costa a corner kick and who knows this might represent their last chance to grab an equaliser over it comes not to be this time what a shocking pass really Chelsea have returned to the high altar of European football. 
Champions League winners. Well, you have to say they deserve it as well. All those training sessions, that toil earlier in the season, the 10 months of the season or so, and now they've got the rewards. Be respectful to the opposition as well. Make sure you congratulate them on a good final before you celebrate with your teammates. A night these Chelsea players will never forget. Well, now for the official presentation. And as a footballer, Lee, in this case, as a Chelsea footballer, this is exactly where you'd want to be. Well, exactly. Getting on to that podium. Huge amount of effort to get there. But this is the this is the icing on the cake. Actually watching your captain pick the trophy up, sharing in that moment. It's a beautiful trophy as well, Derek. It's Chelsea's moment. Champions League winners this season. And my goodness, they deserve it. Brilliant moment. They'll be celebrating long into the night, I'm sure. And then, believe it or not, they'll be focusing in the next few days on next season, no doubt. That's how it works. But for now, it's all about this achievement. Well, this is the moment I love, sharing it with the fans. The ticker tape's coming down, the family's in the stand, giving them all away. Well, they've travelled all over Europe watching this team. Now they get to share in this moment. Fantastic. Well, it took fire as well as ice on the pitch. Now the chance for a photograph. My mum always told me to get on the front row. She taught you well, Lee. There we have it. The Champions League victors.